The defining characteristic of a ball is curvature, and if we can't find any, we've got to come up with another conclusion. This is the Chicago skyline 50 miles across Lake Michigan. The top of the tallest building should be over 300 feet below the curvature of the Earth. If all the other planets are round, why is the Earth not round? Well, we don't believe Earth is a planet. We believe it's a system in which the sun, moon, and stars are smaller, closer, located in our system and do circles above our head. They're simply lights in the sky. That's all we can prove. So why does the shape of the earth matter? Well, whether you believe the Bible or not, it says that you can get to know the invisible attributes of God through the study and appreciation of his creation. If that's the case, of course there's going to be an evil agenda to dilute that. And how do you dilute something? You pour it into something bigger like infinite space and you teach people that they are merely statistical probabilities of an ever-expanding, potentially infinite universe. Elon Musk of SpaceX supposedly put a roadster into space, but check out the earth glitch out. You can tell it's real because it looks so fake, honestly. <laughs> We have way better CGI from this fake. Heidi asks, why don't we see pics of the flat earth from space? Well, it's because there are no pics. They're images or artist representations. Look how the size of the United States changed from 2002 to 2012. Okay? You take a pic, you create an image. Here are the sun and moon doing circles over the flat earth. The sun does not set but retreats into the distance, which you can see on dry days. Here's how a light can appear to set while moving over a horizontal surface using magnification paper as water vapor in our atmosphere, but it does not set any more than the lights in the ceiling set as they move further away. Ships don't sail over the curve of the earth, they simply sail beyond our ability to see them. See how you can bring them back with high powered lenses. Sometimes they do disappear from bottom up, but that's just an effect due to high levels of humidity at water level. Some people say the flat earth can't exist because we have stars that rotate around a southern pole star. Well, it's actually just an illusion created by the atmosphere the further and further away you get from Polaris, the north pole star, which is the center of the flat earth. NASA started by Nazis after Operation Paperclip, the same people that tell you that this is real. Caught with men in the backgrounds of models, bubbles, and scuba gear in space, and of course green screens, and grabbing each other's harnesses on the International Space Station, and their logo has a nice big serpent tongue in it. People say the Bible says the earth is a sphere in Isaiah 40, 22, but Isaiah calls it a circle, and something can be a circle and flat like a pizza. Isaiah uses the Hebrew word for ball in 22, 18, but not describing the earth. There are over 200 verses describing an immovable flat earth set on pillars under a dome or firmament. People say Aristotle's proved the earth was a sphere 2,000 years ago by measuring the shadows of two wells in the same time in different locations. However, these results would be the same for a ball earth with a sun 93 million miles away with parallel sun rays, which we know is not the case, or a flat earth with a smaller local sun. Aristotle's proved the flat earth. The earth spins at 1,000 miles an hour and goes around the sun at 70,000 miles an hour, and the sun goes through the galaxy at 450,000 miles per hour. Yet I can experience a calm morning just like this and continue to land on this same trampoline even though the earth is spinning at 1,500 feet per second. No, babe, we've all seen the Red Bull Space Jump where the guy jumps out of the capsule over planet New Mexico because of the fisheye lens. And then, oh, oh, and then the horizon outside the capsule is flat. The moon does not reflect the light of the sun. It actually gives off its own light. That's proven by the fact that the moon gives off cold light. It's actually warmer in the shadows at nighttime, and that can be tested with a thermometer, which is the opposite of the daytime. So Jesus even said the moon gives off its own light in Matthew. And if the moon is self-illuminating, it can also be self-eclipsing. The mountains of Kanagawa, from over 165 miles away, the tops of which should be over 2,000 feet below the curve of the Earth. If there is no curvature, what conclusion are we left to make? Is the sun 93 million miles away? Or is it a focal image of light entering the clouds right here? So yes, I believe in a flat earth. No, this is not a joke, um, but I think a lot of you have a misconception of what the flat earth actually is. Um, for example, we don't believe we're on a flying pancake in the middle of the solar system where all the other planets are round and the Earth is flat. No, we believe Earth is the pool table. And just because the pool balls are round doesn't mean the table has to be round. 
we believe that Earth is all there is, stationary, uh, with a dome above it, and the sun, moon, and stars are smaller, closer, and they're placed within that dome, and they do circles above our head. And this is what all ancient cultures of the world believed, and they were still able to predict celestial phenomena for thousands of years prior to being told they were on a spinning ball, because they couldn't experience it with their senses. They had to be told. Now, condemnation prior to investigation is either ignorance or it's indoctrination. So, are you big enough to consider something without necessarily accepting it? And can you do that without being triggered? That dude who jumped out of a perfectly good balloon, he would have been about two millimeters above the surface of this globe. They made sure to photograph him standing there with a really wide angle lens, which curves horizontal lines. You don't see the curvature of the Earth if you are two millimeters above this beach ball. <laughs> you just don't. The width of Kansas is 410 miles. A flat, zero point, more flat than 0 0.97. We're just gonna measure the curve, the bulge it should be there, right? So you just measure it, you type in, the calculate, it comes out to 111,801.51 feet of curve it's supposed to be there. You can't have a 21 mile bulge in something that's flat, flatter than a pancake. <clears throat> Here's a very good flat earth model in my opinion. As you can see, the center of our motionless world is the North Pole, and an explorer can still circumnavigate the Earth east to west or west to east. Antarctica is not a continent at the bottom of the globe, but rather a continental ice shelf that holds the waters in and creates a shoreline for the dome above to rest so no falling off the edge. The sun, moon, and stars are smaller, closer, and located inside the dome or firmament and are completely different and part of the Earth system, so no comparing us to them. They are not places you can go, but simply lights in the sky. This model fully explains why compasses only point north and are more and more useless the further south you go. Okay, so today we're going to talk about how TikTok is suppressing my flat earth videos and how I can prove that. So uh, let's open up TikTok. Let's go to my profile. We're going to scroll down to these nine videos. They all have the hashtag flat earth 101. I was doing some explanations on them. Uh, between the videos, there's about 230,000 views. And now I'm going to search that hashtag flat earth 101. And as you can see under that hashtag, there are zero views. So my video is being hidden. Um, let's just check out hashtag flat earth uh, for fun, which I used to be the number one video on there. Now it's uh, some guy trying to debunk my video improperly. Uh, and let's see how many views he has. Oh, 1.2 million. Yeah, I'm done. All right, so uh, first of all, sorry about the distortion. I'm trying to work on this transmitter here. Um, it's tough broadcasting from the International Space Station. Um, yeah, I'm trying to get that figured out. Sorry about that. Um, since TikTok does not allow me to talk about the topic that I used to talk about, um, I got in trouble for they were censoring for me. I decided to take a trip aboard the International Space Station, and uh, it's really quite amazing unless you like personal space. Um, something that's interesting is like when I'm in a rowboat and I push on one side, it's really easy to fall out. Um, uh, because there's repercussions when you move in a rowboat, yet when I'm in here and like I shove off this wall or come back and grab it in, I feel like there's no repercussions. Uh, not to mention the fact that I don't feel like I've ever seen any images or footage of this thing being built. Um, maybe it was always here. All right, so even though I'm now spreading space propaganda, no longer talking about the topic, uh, come over here, baby, you wanna come up? Uh, that I was talking about before, um, TikTok, uh, Fazul's pointed out to me, I hope that's how you pronounce it, that if you click on the audio for my videos, um, which by the way, I'm the first guy to bring that <laughs> child into space, so um, if you click on the audio of my videos, it says that there's no video to go along with the audio. Um, see for yourself. If I do it on my profile, it looks like everything's fine. If I go through another profile, um, yeah, it doesn't work. So pretty crazy. Uh, try to share this if you can. Try to follow. Um, yeah, don't know what else to do. All right, not that anyone is watching these videos anymore because TikTok has decided that uh, no one's going to watch my videos. If you want more information on that, check out the last three videos I posted. Um, I'm starting a new account. If you go to at woke.town, uh, I'm not going to spell that out anywhere just because I'm afraid they'll connect it somehow. If you go to at woke.town, uh, you can find me. 
Uh, that'll be my new account. We need to blow that one up so that we can spread this information as fast as possible before they do it to me again. So, um, and just uh, since I've said that, you might as well check out woke at woke town on Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube. That's where you can find me some of my longer stuff. So, uh, check it out at woke town. Uh, I'm no longer going to be posting on at the woke. Um, because of uh, some stuff that's gone down. So, uh, for posting about a certain topic. So, uh, first video from woke from at woke town is going to be posted tomorrow morning. I uh, hope it's a good one. No, no, Landon. I want that laid up against the side. Okay. Oh, I thought you wanted it laid down flat, like the earth. <laughs>